and we're at the okay, Metro we'll Diner. Metro Diner. So we're gonna get a little bit of lunch brunch, coffee and some nibbles. Do you wanna sit outside or inside? Yeah, they have outside seating, babe. I think I want to sit outside in the thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think we do just sit down. <laughs> it's Mother's Day. Happy Sunday fun day, everybody. How are you? Oh, my goodness. What a weekend. It's been a whirlwind. We're going to do a little dining al fresco hello lucky how are you honey how you doing how you doing where shall we sit i say we sit outside i mean it's not super hot but it's not super cold and stuff hi jennifer hi susan tejas mr bone man shelly and anthony hey yeah i told you you just come outside He's so silly. He's so silly. What am I going to do with him? We're going to sit you guys right here. No water. I'm going to ruin the whole day. I don't want to ruin the whole day. The whole day we get shot. Boom. It would be shot. Maybe we should. Should we put it here? I don't know. It's fine. Sonia, I'm in slouch mode. Timothy, hey there, Randy, Bobby. How did we did we win at the casino? Well, we didn't lose everything. Hey, cool weather farmer. We came out with some money, but not as much as we started with. Yes, happy Mother's Father's. Happy Mother's Day. If you're a mom or a dad to like a kitty cat, a dog, or those things we call children, <laughs> those people or that we the call seven children. Dwarves. Seven dwarves. <laughs> the seven dwarves of Joe. <laughs> Joe's gonna say you want to be inside, aren't you? I love it. This is Mother's Day. This is your show, baby. <laughs> but then we're so loud inside. Oh, we're loud. We, we are. We get loud. very loud. Hi, Susan. We're definitely gonna get some food today. Well, I made breakfast. Well, that's what you did. I did make him. I made him breakfast. I Hi, Colleen. I, I made him breakfast. I, I made him what you guys. Yeah, it is definitely coffee time. We're getting coffee time. And just, and just trying to put me in a corner. You see that? She's trying to put baby in a the corner. There we go. There you go. Baby's not in the corner anymore. Oh my God. He's so high maintenance, folks. But there's no complaining today. Today is Angela's day. There will be I'm complaining. I'm going to limit the complaining to just. Well, hi, Classy. Very How are you? Complaints. It is Sunday fun day. Joe already hi. in trouble. Can we get two coffees to start off with, please? Thanks. Thanks. We got him, babe. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Two coffees. Two coffees to start it's off. It's a little breezy. Breezier than I thought. Oh, that. no. Is that an Angela complaint? Because I'm good. My nipples are standing up. I'm fine. Hi. Hey, BBD. Bo, how you doing? I had to double check. I took my glasses off so I can read. Danette, hello. Hey, Danette. How you doing, girl? Happy Mom's Day, everybody. Yeah, we're just going to get... A little lunchy snack. Are we winners? Well, we played some. And I was down to my last 20. And then I won a couple hundred back. So I'm actually only down like $100. Which isn't terrible considering we spent the afternoon in Atlantic City. We got... The sub shop, White House subs. Oh yeah. my God, it was delicious. We doubled up the meat. Joe always oh. has to go to White House sub. It's not bad. So we got a single sub, big old sub, doubled up the meat, mushrooms. Uh, we, we didn't get mushrooms on it, did we? we? Did? Yeah, I had mushrooms. Did you have mushrooms? I don't I remember. Had Mayo. Oh man, the hot peppers. Whoa, knock it out. Of course, the <laughs> joining the club. Yeah. Yeah. Say hi to Anthony food. for us. Anthony, hello. I didn't know you were there, buddy. I'm almost wondering if we should go inside. Oh. Oh, Angela. You think we should go inside? I don't know. What do you think, boo-boo? 
It's a little chilly. I think we should go inside. <laughs> or should I? What's up, Happy Mother's Day, Joe? Oh, wait, I meant Ange. I know. Well, you know, he's the same thing. Hi. I'm cracking up. We have a table. Hi, Sunshine table. NYC. We have a table dilemma. We should do it before we He is super relaxed. If you, you know want to go inside. We're going to go inside. It's a little too chilly. Inside. It's too cold for Is that okay? Okay, thanks. Thank you. It's a little cold, guys. I'm a baby. I don't have a coat. It's a little breezier than I thought. You want to grab the stuff? And we just go and... Oh, wait. Okay, fine. Yeah, we don't want to mess them up. We're going to mess them up, guys. We're going to mess them up. Shit. I'm already throwing a wrench in the problem. I'm bad. I'm naughty. I can't help it. Hi, Ambrose. I know. It's cold, but it's not like yesterday. Yes. Meow, meow. Oh, hey, Socrates. Happy... Happy Mom's Day, everybody. We're going inside because I'm a problem child. There's room. There's room. I see there's empty tables. I see empty tables. Oh, it's much warmer in here. One minute. Look at Joe's face. He's like embarrassed. Hey, kissy cat. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to get married, but my future children's wish that they want a mother. Well, that happens. All right, we got a spot. We got a spot, guys. We got a spot. It's fresh and delicious, by the way. Oh, we're going. Oh, they are busy. Damn, I wasn't sure we were going to get a spot. It was a little breezy outside, guys. Oh, my God. We literally got the last spot. I can't. That's so funny. Literally got the last spot. All right, folks. Let me flip you all around. I have to put you here. Thank you so much. We'll have to share it. Oh, oh, he's going to do something different. Well, Ange is going to try to make this as difficult as possible. Well, what am I supposed to do? You got to, you got to scooch this coffee, way. Boo -boo. Yeah, sit like there. You can sit there. That's fine. What's the kitty corner? We endorse that table. Hey, British Grey. Hi, RFD. That's how we roll, baby. Good Sunday afternoon. It is Sunday fun day. We're starting out Sunday at our favorite local diner, the Metro Diner. This is what Ange wanted. This is what Ange gets. Hi, Gregory. Yes. Oh, coffee. You know, I actually got up early and I made, like, this is all milk. I need cream. Oh, it's all milk. I need cream. Um, I'm picky. I'm a picky bee. I'm a picky bee. I know. I love coffee, too. We don't. We, nobody, but we all know that nobody can love coffee as much as Joe loves coffee. Is there a competition for who likes coffee more? I'm going to win. Right, Brad. We all know him. that Joe loves most I'm of gonna coffee beat anybody. for everybody. I'm a coffee master. And marriage is too much to have a commitment. The core for marriage is to I can get cream instead of the milk. Yes. Yeah. 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 And baby, she cream. knows. She's a new one. She'll figure it out. I know. Outside coffee would be the best. What do you want to get bacon? What are you getting? Um, I'm going to... Three egg omelet Is that what you're getting? They changed the papers instead of the actual thing. Three okay. eggs deluxe. Is that what you're getting? Three eggs deluxe, baby. Three eggs deluxe. You're going to laugh if I'm going to order. Bacon with a side of bacon? No. Chicken tabaki. Hi, TD Dean. Hey, guys. Your show means a hot dog. Well, you know what? What I you really know, wanted to go if for I today. A hot dog here, wait, I'd get where I really wanted to go today, rolls. but then I realized We're they're closed on Sundays. Is Dominic's? Thank you so much. Sorry about that. No, Dominic. this is. Do you guys need another minute? Or no, another no, 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 we're, we're ready. Good. Okay. Three egg deluxe, please. How do you like guys to be? Um, sunny side up. Mm -hmm. What kind of toast? Um, no toast. Potatoes are okay. No, I'm not gonna eat the potatoes. Lettuce and tomatoes. Yeah, it sounds great. 
And I am gonna have, can I get a side of, a uh, big side of coleslaw and then a side of bacon? I know, that's weird. Thank you so much. No, it's not. Thanks. Hi, Elise. Are you guys laughing? I'm having coleslaw and bacon. I don't know why, but that's what I want. It's her day. She gets what the hell she wants. What are you doing? Why are you rocking everything? Because Joe, stop. You're rocking everything. Spots I don't care. Don't put your arm there. But you don't have to rock. You're going to spill coffee on me, and then I'm going to be mad. Somebody is not happy. No, we're good. Uh, no, I didn't I drive be... home last night. It was late. Right? They're close. I know. I want to. I was actually thinking, God, I really go for one of their hot dogs, but they're closed today. Yeah, I forget that Dominic's is not like a 24 hour place. It's Danette still did a full coffee load. I know. It is comfort food for me the, the coleslaw and the bacon. I might order another bacon. Want me to go order for you? No, let's just see how much I get. The coffee is good. Coffee's good. I've been patting see? that toes forever now. You see the camera. Oh, he did. I can't, I can't, I can't fix that. I mean, I could go like this, but he's still there. He's in the V. Hi, Yoshi Slots. How you doing? He's in the V. You know, you know what's, that is a little strange, I know. Let me tell you, it was really nice meeting Slotnista last night. It was. She was sweet. I like She's her. She's super fun. Lots She's of high energy. She's a good person, yes. I like it. It's good to see people. That's it was really nice, nice thing, to meet up with her. That's the nice thing about the channel. You get to see people and they're cool, you know? Well, you get to see people no matter what, but you get to meet, you meet people. So, she's from the PA area. Yep, Gregory, this is Metro Diner. This is our diner on the corner. Hey, Pradeep. On the occasion of Mother's Day, I'm reminded of an episode during my teens. I used to go early morning tuitions daily as usual. Uh, brush my teeth, drink a cup of water to start. Oh, it's a long story. Rest coming up. Who? Um, her name is Slotsnista. It's Slots and N I S T A. Think of fashionista, but she's Slots and stuff. So, since we were in Jersey yesterday, <laughs> my mother came smiling to me before I could even think of why she was smiling. She lifted her hand and, said, oh, that sounds horrible. I want cool weather. It's boiling in Houston. Well, you know what's funny? Yeah, sunshine and rain. Yeah, she was sweet. Let me tell you. Um, so tomorrow, not tomorrow, Tuesday I fly out to Minnesota and I look at the weather to figure out, because I got to start thinking of packing. I looked at the weather. Hi, Rose. Rose Ellen. Hi, Rosalind. Rosalind. Um, and it's going to be high 70s, 80s. Hi, RJ. 80s. Now I got to really figure out what am I going to pack? Like, what am I going to pack? Everything's all messed up. I usually think of them as colder. Happy Mother's Day, guys. Yeah, so now I gotta like really think about it. Okay. Cycling requires constant pedaling. That's right. Gregory, the stream yesterday was fun playing that game. Which one, if it was like this or that? It is fun to do that. Oh, slat me stop. I was just talking about you, honey. Hi, hello. Hey, girl. Sundresses and thin blouses and shorts. I know, but it gets like to 50 at night. Does it? See, the all of your 13 kids. Oh, my God. Ha Joe. Oh, my God. No. We're still discussing Have the Joe suitcase pack. selection. The suitcase selection is Like, on here's her the mind. thing. I personally don't want yeah. to be bringing. Um, Fantastic. Thank you. Thanks. Coleslaw. Yes. Oh, yeah, no, okay. Perfect. Thank you very much. That's for you. And bacon. Yes, I'll give you some extra. Thanks. Thanks. The bacon. They're so fast here, guys. Oh, I'm happy. Mm. Hey, Robert. I don't know Maybe you don't want to talk about it. Hi there. Slot, that was so fun meeting you yesterday. You and your mom are so damn cute. All right. Let me tell you, RFD, they are so fast here. I can order food from my apartment and it's there in 20 minutes. No matter the amount or the time of day. Hi, Israel. Happy Mother's Day. 
I know some. Bacon's oh, no, good. Tea. Joe got. Where was I born? The three egg special. Yep, yep, yep. With three no eggs. hash brown, so he got salad instead. <laughs> He's got sausage, bacon, and three yeah, eggs, no, no. and a little salad. And I have coleslaw right, and bacon. That's what I'm eating today. And this morning I made like a, um, it's kind of like a Dutch baby. <laughs> Coffee is so adult for you? Yes, hi, Chiricano. Felicidades a todos la madres en la mundo. No idea what Happy Mother's Day to all the moms, all the moms around the world. I think that's what that said. I hope I was right when I tried to read that. I, like, Spanish is a romantic language, so it's very similar to things in French, too. Okay. So you can sometimes read it between it. So, today we were sitting here going, what do we do? And I said, well, let's get some coffee first, and we'll have a little snack. Is there ham in there too? You got like a three meat special. It's a deluxe. Hi, Treat. Hi, Enrique. It's a deluxe, guys. Zippity doo chat. I know it's fast, right, three today? It's a deluxe. So we were debating about do we just go for a walk in the park? And do we get in the car and then we go up to the cloisters and show that along the Hudson, which is really nice. It's beautiful. I haven't been up there yet. I like that idea. You can speak Spanish in seven different languages. You're so crazy. I'm gonna tell you guys, if you guys are ever on the Upper West Side and you guys want just to go to a diner that has good food, seriously, go to Metro Diner. Everybody we've ever taken here, I don't think has ever said it's been bad, right? Right. It's always good, it's always consistent. Yeah, the cloisters are beautiful. Now. Are you going in? I can take you in because they are on it. I Their docents are on it. What did I do? Did I drop stuff on me? Go on. Okay. So I can't take you in, but I can take you all along the grounds outside of the area and the park. I can see our favorite uh, hedgehog. I yes. got a hedgehog at the ground hunt. Here comes the international hello greeting of the day, people. My mother spoke fluent locust valley lockjaw. All the moons up to Hi Tina Guzman. Hello. Happy Mother's Day, guys. Happy Mother's Day to you. I don't know how you read this chat. It's going too fast. Joe can't he gives he has to like stop and look at Oh, it's Latvian. Svelki Vizium. Svelki. Zvaiki Visia. Everybody say it with me. Zvaiki Visia. Latvian. So funny. I don't know how you do that, but Classy. Like, you come up with this stuff, and I'm like, oh my God. Thanks, Classy. Have a piece of bacon. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Everybody, have a piece of bacon. Thank you. Tune in next time with a hello from around the world. No. Colleen says, Joe, I've never had a coffee. Okay. What? How is that possible? Did you hit me with like Spanish or something? Because I can't understand that. You're eating. You're eating bacon right now, too? I know the bacon is good. Who said she never had a coffee? They do the bacon good here. They don't overcook it. But I hate when it's overcooked. I recommend you have a cup. Don't have it black. He does. He has to stop eating. He can't do two things at once. Like, he literally pauses. Don't have it black. You're going to do coffee? Put some cream in it. I do it black sometimes because they don't have the right stuff. No, not for a new person. Don't don't have it black. You'll never have coffee again. you got to get used to it. You live by a bacon outlet? Is that called a pig farm? Hey, lucky old baby. Look at that coffee. That's my girl. I know. Lucky O's my girl. It doesn't compute to Joe. More coffee for you guys? Yes, please. Please. 
New York is an excellent city. However, I did notice that you pointed, and I won't wouldn't point because it's rude. Actually, you know what I was taught by a friend that you shouldn't point. You should use your hand like this, like that, like a sword. Like, I never learned that lesson. Sorry, guys. Here you go. Don't point. Go over there with an open palm. Joe, not Joe. Have you ever heard that? Mm-hmm. Black with a tad bit of sugar. You use tequila flavored coffee creamer. Oh my God. Angela made me a peanut butter coffee yesterday at Wawa. Yes. A Hi, peanut Sergio. butter coffee at Wawa. That was sensational. Yes. Yeah, so when we were driving home, one of the things we do on the way back from AC is we, there's a spoon right there. Boom. We always stop at the Wawa. And then Joe's like, Angela, can you please make my coffee? Because you make it so good. And so I had to make this coffee. I can point anytime. She's very talented. This is Joe. You guys. Just don't point. Just be like, you. Hello. Hello. And they had flavored coffee. Like they always have hazelnut, they always have vanilla, and I never choose those for him. But they had one that was peanut butter. Hi, Walt. Hey, Walt Money. How you doing, babe? There's a rumor going around he's dating 103-year-old women. Well, that's me. Say that again? <laughs> Somebody, there's a rumor that's saying my husband dates a 103-year-old woman. Good luck, friends. Good luck. Have a great time. <laughs> anyway, so I made them mostly with a medium roast, and then I put a splash. Hassan, happy Mother's Day. Yep. Hi, Hassan. I put a splash of the peanut butter coffee in it. And it was black. It's not like sugar. It's not sweet. like it was a splash. It was all uh-uh. peanut butter. It was honestly like the big 24 ouncer, and there was like mostly it was this much regular medium roast, and then there was this oh, much. Really, BBD? You drink your coffee black? Well, that's okay. As long as you're drinking coffee. As long as you enjoy it. As long as you're a member of the coffee community. I give you credit for being a member. You cannot be a member it doesn't make a difference you don't drink coffee you can't be a member of the coffee community that's how it works yeah they can they can drink the milk no there's strict membership you got to drink coffee oh my god stop but anyway that peanut butter coffee was so overwhelming smelling it smelled like joe had a reese's peanut butter cup it was unbelievable it felt it tasted like you know screwball in my coffee it did not taste like screwball screwball is a peanut butter liqueur it was delicious like, I can't drive drinking this coffee, honey, because I'm drinking and driving it, baby. But we did get home safe and sound. We got home around 2 a.m. 13 kids, coffee's your life. I hear you. I believe it. I got I seven people bro. inside my head. Coffee's not inside there all the time. Do I think? I don't know what that means. Toby's a Scranton. Scranton PA. Yeah, but Scranton what? The Scranton Stranger. Who's Toby? And what's the Scranton? He said Strangler. Some strangler. Um, who's Toby? Strangler doesn't sound good. Two Ooh. black ice Bustellas every day. Ooh. Yeah, you're Bustella. Going, you're going for it, Trayton. Bustella is it. the New York coffee. That's what we drink. Bustella at home. Everybody in New York drinks the Bustella. Uh oh, something got hidden. Thank you, Anthony. We got the best mods in the business. Mm-hmm. Hey, Glenn. Thai Downtown food? Manhattan has excellent cuisines. The Thai food is splendid. However, I would watch out for dangerous tribes that hide in the bushes and attack you when you aren't looking. What? Oh, we're okay. We go during the daylight. Spray my elbow. <laughs> Yo, Randy, you're just a mess. We love our Randy. I love you guys are taking care of these people. They're all out today in full force. Yeah, it's Mother's out, Day, apparently. Out, baby. They got nothing to do. Get your sabers out. Lightsabers. Draw your lightsabers. Draw out your lightsabers, folks. Gentlemen, May the and force ladies and gentlemen, be use, with you. use the force and get those lightsabers rocking and rolling. May the force be with you. That's what I like to see. I like to see you guys going after them. Mm-hmm. Mods are on it. Mods are on it, baby. Your guys are rock. I prayed mods. The whole, I don't even know who that is. <laughs> I don't know who that family is. You want some bacon? Here, you can have some bacon. Let's, te- some bacon. let's teleport our bacon to you. You giving it to me? No. I thought she was offering me a, a 
bacon on a Mother's Day. Hi, Mercedes. Day. No, you already ate. Oh, you had bacon, ham, and sausage. I think I did. Hi, Avery. Hello, Avery. Welcome into the chat and the house. Yeah, they're on the manager noble troves. I don't understand it. You're so far ahead of them. The funniest thing, I'm like, I don't know. Guys, they don't know if it's going to be one check or do you want separate check? Uh, together, together, right? Dutch Dewey Egbert's Coffee. Ooh, Dewey Dutch Egbert's does Egbert's Coffee. Egbert's? I haven't heard that one. I haven't heard of Egbert's Coffee. I'll have to look into that. You had a bacon, ham, sausage this morning, too. Oh, well, Ambrose, you and John are winning. You can only drink one cup of coffee a day, Bobby. I do love my meat, Lucky O. I'm a, I'm a meat master. Meat. That's because, Bobby, you eat, eat too much chili. Time. If you didn't eat so much chili, you could drink more coffee. Oh, Randy's a chili. He's the chili guy. Everybody's got to have, their, love gotta have their strong suit. No, this is not my house. This is a diner. Yeah, we just push the bed up and invite people in. <laughs> Look, I'll show you. It's a diner. It's called the Metro Diner. It's mo moist. Moisty? Yeah, moist. Moist. Glassy, hello. All right. It's really good here. It's the best. So it's really chilly outside. I got my sweater on. I'm getting warm inside. What is I'm going doing on good. With Sister Yoshi, happy Mom's Day to you, too. Yeah. Hey, Sister Yoshi. Somebody say, hey, hey Joe. It's you Sonia. Know what? Hi, Sonia. Tell your mom. Tell Mama Yoshi happy birthday for lunch. Happy birthday. Did I say happy birthday? Said happy, birthday. happy Mother's Day. Oh my God. I'm a mess. Can I get a check, please? I know. Thank Anybody you. guess are sitting behind me. Hi, Sir Saunders. I get a show on the road. I know. Have I ever? You don't think you've ever watched a streamer bus at the diner? We've done it a couple times. We haven't sat here before. We usually sit over there, and it says fresh and delicious behind us all the time. Yeah, we're sitting hey, over here. Hey, sweet dreams. It's a busy, it's a busy time today. Mm-hmm. Busy, busy. I originally sat outside, but then I got chilly. We were outside. They actually brought our coffee inside. That was nice of them. <laughs> oh, no, he had bacon, guys. Thank, Thank you, so, you much. so much. He had bacon. He ate it so fast that it's gone. Now he's going to pay. And I'm going to finish my coffee. Abandoned me. Oh, it keeps repeating what you're saying unless you keep hitting the refresh. Yes. If you guys are new here, do me a favor, subscribe to the channel if you like what you see and stuff like that. That's my that's my commercial. <laughs> no, we're not ending the stream. We're gonna continue on. I think we're gonna go up to the cloisters. We're gonna go. And check out the beauty up there. That bacon was good. I can eat another whole side of it. They only give you like five slices. That's not enough. You guys are the best family ever. Oh, thank you so much. Hello. I saw a recipe yesterday for portobello mushroom meats. I thought of you. Oh my god, that sounds delicious, Gregory. Yes, I do live in New York. You, you want to see the parking spot photos? You're going to crack up. I got to get this in. Got to get it in. Okay, now I'm done. I probably should take a swig of water. Oh, the reason why she says don't spam the chat because what happens is a sweet dreams. Sometimes YouTubes will time you out and they don't like when you drop a ton of emojis. It has nothing to do with us. It actually has to do with YouTube and its algorithm. Like they get cranky when you start dropping a ton of emojis over and over. They consider it spamming the chat. That's my choice. Good. Okay. Your name is Busha Hawk. Is that how I say it? Hi? Busha? Boisha? Spell it phonetically and I can say it. Ange, maybe, right? Maybe right, but I need my chili from Wendy's. I know. Okay, hang on. You guys want to see where we parked? This is because we're special. We're extra special. <gasps> That's a baby call. Look. Look where we got to park today. Is that funny or what? 
You couldn't get much better. Look, Metro Diner, up there, I'm telling you guys, that's where the Beastie Boys first started practicing together with their friend. Their friend owned an apartment up there and that's where they would go. How cool is that? I think that's pretty damn cool. And I'm not lying. It is an excellent spot, right? Okay, now I'm hot. Because you know why? It was warm in there and I had all that coffee. Awesome. Yeah, Joe reminds me of the guy from Tekken 2 Hot. I don't even know what that is. Hihachi Mishma. Now I gotta look that up. I love NY, but never been, but I know I would love you. you I was. <laughs> I'm gonna open some windows. Whew. I'm proud of some driving lessons in New York City. Driving lessons? I'm just gonna keep you guys on the gimbal because it's easier. So you guys know how to drive properly in the city. Driving etiquette, driving experiences. Kelly Jean is so cute, and you're a little kitty. Hi, all from Iraq. How are you? Ali, is it Ali? Ali from Iraq. It's not the, it's because of the coffee. I drink two cups of coffee super fast. All I had was bacon and, and coleslaw. I'm a cheap date. No um, sleep till above Metro Diner. Yeah, it totally is. She is, is not a cheap date. You're she cool. You're cool, sweet dreams. She is Hi, Ben. The best slice to get in your in New York, your opinion. My opinion, honestly, the best slice that I like, just because it's our one of our favorite places and they always make it fresh for us, is what is it called? Little Cheers. Italy? But you know, Mama's Pizza up here is fantastic. Mama's too. Mama's too. Well, it's part of Mama's Pizza. They do the um Detroit style, but it's not super doughy. It's very crispy. Does YouTube give strikes? Yes. Well, they'll give strikes on channels. Is that what you mean? But YouTube will time you out sometimes. Like the algorithm will just kick you out sometimes. It's happened. Yeah, coffee makes me hot. It's all the damn caffeine. Hey, USA. USA. Now we're on Broadway, waiting to get to the West Side Highway. The horn is going to be used. As what is a going tool. on here? Is everybody all backed up? I don't understand. This is never walkers busy. Walkers in the ditch. Oh my God. Walkers exactly. in right, the Ambrose, ditch. Exactly. Right, Ambrose. We got. We're using the horn already. For God's sake. Oh, um, oh. Go. Here it goes. Once you start doing it, everybody does. And, yes, and Google. He was a fighter in the game. A... Okay, I'm going to totally Google that. Hey, Chester Kyle's world. You're on Broadway too. I know. It's like we're twinning. You're in PA Broadway. You're on Broadway PA, and I'm in Broadway in New York. I wonder if there's a Broadway everywhere. You live in the UK and the best pizza we get f is frozen? Hmm, you gotta look into that. Domino's is awful. Oh, it is, it is totally crowded today. Joe was out earlier. All the flower shops. Is it hot in here? Is it just, and oh, you're funny, Gregory. Um, All the flower I'm shops. cooling off now. Everybody's, yeah, everybody's buying flowers. I got tulips again this morning, it was so nice. The mothers three, threw all the kids out and dads, yes. Hi, Ron now. TV. Three dozen. If you get a parking spot in front of H&H, &H, that would be impressive. That would be impressive. We just find a parking we gotta, spot we gotta, wherever we can. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Let's go. What is happening here, people? Why are you guys still driving on the... I, I can't. These people are idiots. Thank you. That's beautiful, sweet dreams, all those flowers. Oh, okay. We're going to sneak in. I don't know. Beware. Beware. This guy's going to go somewhere. Look at this idiot. I swear to God. She's hanging out the car. Like, what are you going to do? Direct traffic from your car? For real, woman. Get back in the vehicle. The man you're with is an idiot. I'm sorry, guys. That was angry of me, but he's in this little tiny Fiat thinking he's all that. And I'm like, dude, you're driving a toaster. I can't. Oh, Joe's going to get behind the toaster. I'm going to horn the toaster. Don't horn the toaster. Oh, he's got a chain around his Yeah, he's plate. all he's all spippy. Look at guys. Oh, he's got a chain. When people put that kind of thing on the back, what are you doing? Because he fucking... What are you backing up for? You know what? Next time, I'm just going to go fucking head on, okay? Joe, calm down. Right. Calm down. Fine. No, calm no, down. Head on. No, Joe. I won't back up. Oh, my God. I'm going to jam people. him against that car. Okay, we're back. Right. This guy in this little Fiat. Okay. It's red. It's red, Joe. It's red. Oh, my God. 
Joe's better now. He's he's away from those people. <laughs> Jet Lucky's like WTF. People. Swear to God. Crowded like walkers. the problem was is they sat there. There are two lanes. It's not a left only lane. There are two lanes that go straight. They're all in the right lane. It's not like they're all they're all trying to go straight. And then the and then the, the traffic's still going through the red light. It's ridiculous. And she's hanging out the car. <laughs> Triple you know G. You know what Triple G said? are not respecting the Wait, lights. Wait, Triple G says go monster truck on them, Joe. I'm going to horn it. Does, is there anybody walking in front of me? No, USA, quit asking to be a mod. I already have my mods in place. I don't USA. just, I just don't hand out my, I don't hand out, Joe, Joe calm out. down. Just, I don't, I don't just hand out tools. Lightsabers I, are very prized items. I'm not Home Depot. We love our lightsabers. The road rage is scaring you. <laughs> It's okay. It's not true road rage. Not yet. It's not true road rage. To get them three minutes later funny, I know. And just gonna get a lightsaber icon, I swear to God. That's gonna be so awesome. That would be funny. We've changed our wrenches to lightsabers. But I can't change what the wrench looks like. That's I would love YouTube. To do that. That's YouTube driven. I know. Look at there's a blue sky. It. Yeah, never asked to be a mod. I will choose who we need. Hi, Donald. Maria, how are you? Hello, guys. I'm driving, baby. We're playing soccer. You're only a mod because you threatened to release the pictures. Yeah, right, Robert? Yeah, Robert's got some good pictures. <laughs> He's got good pictures of naked chili. He's got pictures of chili. Hi, Ben. This, this car is dog walking. You see that? I feel like I'm dog walking. Uh, honey, I don't care. I don't care about that car. Stop. I don't care. You don't see dog walking. Joe, I don't care. That's, I don't, I don't care. I see a lot of those in Detroit. Yes, we used to see a lot of those in Detroit. Well, today I think we're going to go up towards the Cloisters and we're going to go take a look at their gardens. And I have pictures of Joe drinking tea. Oh my God. Does YouTube give strikes for bad words? Well, what happens is if I end up swearing a lot, or there's a lot of that happening, YouTube will not push the video out, according to what I've heard. Is that true? Joe looks like Jason Bateman's older brother. That's funny. Anthony, I helped bury some of them. I'm still laughing about the toaster car. Well, it is, it was a, it was a damn little Fiat. Do you know how much that car stickers at, by the way? But they're like a toaster. Dressed up and stickered at 30 grand. 30 grand, that car. 30 it's grand. A small little car. Yeah. Sticker because it's a performance car. Fiat performance car. But it's not a performance it's car. It's as much as my Jeep. But it's stupid. It's not even a performance car. It's they a toaster. A with a performance logo on it. It's a toaster with wheels. And they call it. I mean, everybody knows that Fiat is not a good car. Not him. He thinks it's a good car. I know. He put a license plate that has like the chain yeah, around it. Is he's so bad. Take the train next time? No. Oh, we have to do the bay landing. But well, we're not doing that today. You have to tell them about that. I've told them about it. Oh, that's right. The aircraft carrier. I forgot. I forgot you told them about that. Lucky's like, they'll kick you off your channel. You should know about it. Yeah, Lucky's, Lucky's thing is like, uh, always like that. Lucky's stick is swearing. Your 2021 Honda Civic hatchback is small, but turbocharged. Okay. Yeah, it, I don't know. I've heard that they they don't try to they don't push your thing out as much. I don't know if they've kicked you off because of profanity because you just had the thing marked if you're not for children or whatever. Hey, Morton from Norway. Are we marked but, for children? No, we are not a children's channel. Okay, just making sure we're in the right. Hi, ice yarn. <laughs> Mechanics use this for Fiat's. Fix it again, Tony. <laughs> I haven't heard that one before. That's funny. It's true. That's that's what it stands for. Fix it Fix again. Fix it again, Tony. Hi, Big B. Big P and Tone. Hello from Gila River Res, south of Phoenix. Oh, we got people from Phoenix. Hi, Lila. Can you believe it? it looks like it's actually... You have a box of vodka? Vodka? 
Comes in a box? I didn't know that. I didn't know vodka came in a box. Okay, well we're gonna take... Wait, did I do the right one? Which one? Okay, I did. I'm like, oh my God, did I do the wrong person? No, I did. I'm done with the blew me, blew me. I'm, I blewed you right out of here, sorry. We don't ask for wrenches. Yeah. <laughs> Is there a new Ozark I need to watch? Yeah. Anthony, did you? Oh, you look, Anthony. You're so funny. <laughs> you tried. You tried to do it the same time I did. I'm laughing. Everybody is like, "We're done with you. We're done with you. We're done with you, sir." This conversation can serve no more useful purpose. No, it's not how it goes. This conversation. Can serve, can no longer serve any purpose or something. I can't remember, but not the words that you said. This conversation has no useful purpose. Does Joe have a favorite brand of tequila? Yes, he does. Yes, I do. But he likes to buy different brands to make sure that he still likes the one brand. Well, the one we just got at uh, Costco is not bad. It's not bad, but it's, it's still not a Hornitos. It's actually, I had some. Yeah, it's a certain palate. Oh my god, that's like a hell answer. <laughs> I said I wasn't going to complain on Mother's what Day. What are you something. doing, Dave? <laughs> Dave? <laughs> Dave? <laughs> uh, Joe's like, get away from the cluster fuck. I know. Like Dave Jeep Grand Cherokee. Is it? No, it's now. a Jeep. It's just a Jeep. No Wrangler. Wrangler. I information. True, we don't get heat waves the way you do. I'm so jealous. Look at it, we're banking around and my gimbal's like, whoa, whoa, we're twirling. Remember last Look at time that. we came down and we saw a car in the rock with a cop car next to it? Oh yeah, that was in right. Like, in, a, in a perfectly dry condition, he ran into the side and into the I rock. say good day, sir, yes. Right here, he just did this. Look like, at this, look at this thing, look at that. Isn't that cool? Wait, 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 there it is. Look at that, it's so that ancient That is from like Helm's Deep. Uh, Hel Helms Deep. Joe is all Lord of the Rings on us. It's very Lord of the Rings. Look at we're here. We're at the cloisters. We're very Lord of the Rings. Isn't that fun? Like it just took us like what ten minutes? I don't know. It wasn't that. We ate. Oh, now this is gonna be. This is gonna be the thing. It's Mother's Day. Everybody in the city's gonna be here. Everybody's gonna be here, but we're not Why? going inside because they will not allow me to live stream. I am merely a contract driver on Mother's Day, and I'm not the creator on this channel. And if anybody has a question about that, please see the complaint department. It's Walking commuter today. looks out for a work English on his thing. The complaint department is Freaking kids today. out here outside here on Broadway fighting, really? Did you hear that? The cloisters well Did you hear that? What? the complaint department is closed today. Oh, okay. The cloisters actually it was um, it was moved here. You wanna show them what it is? I'm gonna show you guys. We're gonna walk outside, I'm gonna show you it's well, beautiful. Go here? But oh, yeah, go around. right. Go around. Um go around. Okay. He's still trying to figure he's out. He's trying to figure out where he's going. I saw some people just popped in here. Hey, Cammy. Hey, Tanya. Look. Oh, look it actually views. sits. Look at the views. It sits over the Hudson River. Here, we'll show you where it is. We're gonna park right. Are we gonna park here? We're gonna show you. Park, right? We're not sure what we're gonna do. We're gonna I think you can park up there, Joe. Go park oh, the car. I don't know what you're doing. Cause somebody's gonna park and take a spot, and we're not gonna have one. Oh, oh, maybe there is no spot. Maybe There's yeah. lots of spots. Everybody's parallel parking with the Jeeps. I know they're not parking like they normally park. Joe's going to pull in and go in front. I, I love your 16 channel. Feet. 16 feet, guys. 16 but I have to feet. go. I always watch the replay. No worries, Bobby. You take care. Bobby, we love you. People sleep on that song. Kissy Cat. I don't even know what song that was. Okay. All right. We are exiting the vehicle. Are we exiting the vehicle, boo? Yes. Popping it. Okay, we're popping it. Popping what? <coughs> okay. Out the car. Out the car. Out the car. Okay. Now, this is the cloisters. It was actually built and brought over here. It was brought over, right? From a it was brought over here, reassembled from England, right? 
Thanks, Kissy Cat. Yeah, it was an abbey that was brought over here. The cloisters, that's like a, you know. But it it is like medieval in there. You actually feel like there, there are tapestries. There's actually, if you guys ever look up and you see those tapestries of the unicorn hunt, they're here. This is where they're at, the original tapestries. They're absolutely beautiful. And, the, and it's yeah. amazing, the yeah. weaving that went into them. Right. I wish I could take you guys in there, but this is part of the Met, the Metropolitan Museum of Art. Which is fantastic, but they are really Which strict. is amazing and fantastic, really but they are video. incredibly strict. You've tried, didn't you try a couple times? Um, I've actually done some video in here and they freak out. Like even by the tapestries, they do not allow, they don't want you to take pictures because if they're afraid people won't turn off their flash, which would then in turn damage the tapestries. Yeah, pretty crazy about it. They're very strict. The docents here do not play. Can we go look at our favorite groundhog first? I want to go see our groundhog. What do we he's, call him, Fred? He's the resident. He's the resident. Fred the groundhog. Yes. He's the resident. Let's go see if we can find our groundhog because he he's lives over here. He's camping out, eating. I know you guys are thinking I'm funny, but no, there's a groundhog that's he's always a here. Huge groundhog. It's quite large. They have a beautiful garden inside and around the whole place, right. but inside it's like a little bitty. Um, they actually have a square cafe too, right? It's a proper little garden. And they have a cafe with coffee. And they actually have poisonous plants there. Oh, that's right. Remember? There was like a poisonous garden. Because the strength, they have like nightshades and all that stuff. Of, the strength of your king is the strength of his poison. Oh, is it blurry? Hang on. Fred or is it George? I can't. Maybe it is George. I don't remember. We just name we just have up. To, we have to keep it it's one of those two. We have to be consistent. Be consistent. Let's go see if he's there. I want you guys. He's I want you guys to well, see it. There's a dog up there. The dog might scare him away. Oh, well, he's not on the ground. Oh, there is a dog up there. Isn't it beautiful, guys? Maybe he's further back. See, it's so pretty. Remind you of um, what's that movie with uh, um, Monty Python? The Wall. Monty Python. The Wall. Remember? Run away! Run away! I spit at you, <laughs> Monty Python, and the Holy Grail. They're on the wall. I at you. <laughs> Say hi on my way to my parents' grave. <laughs> Kimmy, have a good day. In the concrete jungle. Nice. Yeah, this is just north of Manhattan. Or, you know, the city. It's a beautiful place. The grounds here are amazing. He does, yeah, the dogs were up here, so they're not, but he's always out here. We see him in the evening all the time, and we crack up, because he's so fat. See, like right here is one of the gardens. You guys can see the trees that are blossoming. Now, if you are a New York resident, it is a New York City resident, I think. It is pay, as you, pay what you wish and stuff, and that's, you know, which is cool. You know, they do have a lot of funding and stuff. They changed that just uh, after COVID, right? Yes. Because it was New York, New York State, right? Well, I think it was always pay what you wish, but now they've changed it to only people that live here. It's gorgeous grounds. And when you walk inside, it literally, they actually have, you guys are going to crack up, but there's actually like, um, the tombs or sarcophagus, sarcophagus things, crypts of like people from medieval times in here. It's so cool. They have all of the stuff that's, you know, like from churches and the gold and the chalices and, you know, there, it's not called a requiem. What is it called? Um, holy objects. There's somebody who looks like Joe. It's Joe. Kathy Patron. Coffee tasting tequila. I have actually tried it. It does look like a monastery and a cloister actually was like an abbey for nuns. Joe, are you looking for him? Joe's looking for the groundhog. He's cracking me up. Well, because it's probably midday and he's probably chilling. 
Yeah, he comes out on the grass and we see him all the time. Yeah, he's looking for medieval treasure. Treasure. Hey, Jesus in the disco. I missed you in here. What? A cardinal? But let's go take a look along the thing. Ange, they consider the cloisters to be part of Washington Heights. Yes, they do. Oh, I know. It's just at the very edge. This is a commanding view of the Hudson. It is. And that's why they have, Fort, they have Fort Washington over here. Yeah, Fort Washington's there. And it's got a really good view. Seems like a very inclusive city. It is a very inclusive city. Um, you pretty much can do whatever, look like whatever. I mean... Yeah, nobody really says anything to you. Joe, go dispatch that bunny. Joe's going to find some doggies. Joe's looking for dragons, is what you feel like. He wants to see... We'll see him on the way out, maybe. He is the, he is the biggest, fattest groundhog ever. He, but all I say is, this groundhog, or his family, they live here. And I just laugh. I'm like, he's got the best damn life. Like he was, he was, he's like the, he's like the people that live in like the high end neighborhoods. He lives here. <laughs> That's what I cracked. What did Ben say? Oh yeah. It's very close. Joseph, you're not going to find him. I'm going to laugh when that groundhog comes popping out at you and it's going to be like Caddyshack all over the place. How does a groundhog dance? Should I sing? I'm all right. <laughs> Nobody worry about me. <laughs> he just does a little twist. He does the twist. I know he makes me think of Caddyshack. All right, let's go over to the riverfront. We're way up. I know. We're not going to trip, guys. We're not going to trip. This is our little Mother's Day Sunday fun day excursion. Oh yeah, Ben, it totally is. I know, but Joe's in the middle of the street, so they're stopping. Niagara Falls is the big, the farthest you've been your way. I can't wait to go back up there this summer. We're gonna head up there. It is one of the best movies. This is the view. Oh. You can hear the West Side Highway right down there. They do. Joe's Elmer J. Fudd impression. Joe's rabbits, not groundhogs. That's the Hudson River. Goes all the way up north. The rain's knocked all the hoods off. You were on the Maid of the Mist when you were 12? Picking season soon will be hitting up Vermont and Maine. Picking for what? What kind of picking? That's where we go. Like some, for some farm stuff? stuff? Strawberries? No, strawberries? Strawberries aren't till the... Well, strawberries happen... No, it can't be that much later. Fruits and veggies, okay. I've been on the Maid... Yeah, I've been on the Maid of the Mist, too. It's yeah, been forever. Cool. Could you imagine if we went on the Maid of the Mist? Oh, my gosh. Joe remembers that it was stinky. Right? But they said they... they I think they have the disposable ones now. Follow the Hudson all the way to your house for a barbecue. Oh, my God. That would be amazing. Barbecue. They're going to see us all the graduation scene is great in stripes. Mm -hmm. Yellow rain, right, you remember the yellow raincoats? Oh, they have a little doxy. But those yellow raincoats always smelled so bad. Funky. Oh, look at this tree, it's so beautiful. It's pretty creepy. Show them the Abbey how it looks, the Abbey looks so cool. Have you ever been up to the top of the That's okay, you'd walk all the pizza off, Ben. It's very green. Right? Lucky you still got coat. You still got soaked even if you're wearing that yellow that yellow slicker. Hi John. Happy Mother's Day to all the moms. Oh, it is 
It, no, it's like a it's like a brindle or whatever. It like tiger. tiger yeah. it's not a dapple, is it? No, it's not a dapple. Dapple is what. Um, so what is it? It's like striped. It's like a tiger coat. I can't remember what they call it. Yeah. Everybody loves to walk their dogs up here. Apparently, dachshunds are the dog of the day. They still haven't fixed this part of the um, thing. Do you want to tell them what happened here, or do you don't believe me? What happened? The car drove off. No, I think it just broke. No, because there are parts down at the bottom. Stop. I told you that. You didn't believe me. There, what, what, how, okay, let me ask you a question. How did that happen when there's none of this is damaged? Joe. He's saying a car drove up here and shot across. He's so full of crap. So like, do you see this? Like this whole brick thing. This has been damaged for like a year. Okay. Move out of the way. Move out of the way, sir. There are no damn... There are no car parts down here, Joe. You the car parts, Angela. There were car parts in glass. I don't think so. I showed you that you denied me. You told me no. How in the hell did this wall break like that? I think it was broken and they had to dismantle it. The car would not have taken... Wait, wait, I'm going to dismantle and throw the bricks on the other side of the road. I think it broke and fell down. I think it got damaged and it I broke. Do. Down There's no way a car came cruising down. Uh, what was it? A big dumb? I, I mean, it. Yeah, I can't. Literally, cannot. I That's the can't. bridge that we went underneath the arch. I know, guys. We're arguing about like how that thing broke. I know how it broke. It's a ginormous wall. Ninjas that attacked the place did it. <laughs> They're trying to breach the wall with a car. Breach the wall. They were trying to breach the wall, folks. It was a car. It was not a car because one, your car would just smash up against it. It wouldn't break it. Yes, it would. What kind of car is it? Was it a Fiat? I don't remember the car. I didn't see the car. Have you ever seen the movie Step Away? Sleep Away Camp? No, I've never seen it. That's why you don't text and drive, says Ambrose. That's quite the fall, though. And it matches Isn't it cool that you can walk around New York even though you live in the UK? It does not match the size of a car. Yeah. Joe, you're ridiculous. See guys, that's what he's talking about over there. The Rockefellers bought the land across the river from the park so nothing would ever be built on it. Yes, they did. I mean, the Rockefellers had a ton of money. And the crazy thing is, if I'm not mistaken, I think I'm correct. They were also very influential in the stuff in um, Mount Desert Island, in Acadia National Park. Because they would call the, the rocks and the stones along a thing, Rockefeller's teeth or something like that. Look it up. But Mount Desert Island, Acadia National Park, they have a lot of um, bridal trails, things like that. It's beautiful. He needs to stop. He's like ridiculous. He's taking a picture. He's going to look it up. Really, Joe? Are you going to show me that? He can't find a car park. He's so... Oh. A car park. Randy says, I see tire tracks. Uh, no, I saw a crash. I actually saw the landing mark, but Angel wouldn't believe me when it actually I happened. I can't. Oh, for God. real, Joe. Were you here when it happened? No, I wasn't. I saw it a few weeks after. A few weeks after? Really? I'm telling you, car crashed in there. Yeah. Don't eat chili and drive, guys. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's okay. First time I'm, my I'm not ridiculing you. I'm just saying I can't believe that. Well, it's impossible, right? Cars don't drive through walls? I don't know. <laughs> Rockefellers did great things to preserve American history. They did. If he was only <coughs> yeah, this is Joe's around. investigation team. Trust me, guys. I'm right. I'll have to check that out, John. Danette, you guys have a good day. All right, guys. Thanks for coming in. We'll see you later. We're still living. They're going. <laughs> Everybody comes and go. You guys come and go as you please. We're going to put on a stair step demonstration later on down this. I am not doing here. the steps on these things. Show them the steps with no handrails. You trust Joe? Okay, Robert. 
Like the steps over here. These are insane. We will agree to disagree. Look, look, look. They're super no steep. Handrails. No handrails, guys. All stone. Stone. And th the steps They're are so shallow. tiny. They're very shallow. Dan's going to put on a step demonstration. Not a single handrail present. There's nothing to even grab. There's not even a rock to grab onto. You're going to go down, down, down. Like if you trip on that. You're all done. Hi, Viking 180. You're done. Yeah, they're really steep. And they're actually short and steep, yes. And they're very shallow. Like, your whole foot can't stand on it. You gotta go down them on your tiptoes. There is no rail. There's a channel you've watched on YouTube with luxury apartments for like millions of dollars. They're just amazing. Oh my God. So yeah, that's, that's ridiculous. A whole that's a whole different level of- Oh, Lila, I'm telling you, of course. I would, have, I would face plant. I mean, when I went down it, I was like, this is a mess. We're stuck the gardens, Angela. Angela, start the gardens. I know. We're coming up to the gardens, guys. We want to check gardens them out. Are beautiful here. Really, really beautiful. Can you believe how green it is now suddenly? Like the trees just popped. Do you see how big that tree is? Look how big that... Look how big. That is a massive tree. It feels like 100 years old. How old is it? At least 100. A million? I see... It's not a fucking redwood. <laughs> I would love to see the redwoods. It's not a redwood. Hi, Diana Lee. I know. It's amazing. It's a big tree. Look at this one. Look at this tree. Joe's, Joe's so excitable. Joe's like, that's a big tree. It's still green, isn't it? Joe is a tree hugger. He'd go hug that tree. Jump the you couldn't, you oh, can, but you can't. You'd you can't. Like, Follow my gravity. This is a, that, that, uh, that Eastern red bud. I now remember the name of that tree that I always go, the one with the purple flowers. And then everybody goes, it's an Eastern red bud. I'm like, oh yeah, that's what it is. It's a very steep hill climb. Woo. That's the Westside Highway, Henry Hudson. Uh, Joe's doing his, Joe is just constantly doing his Superman stance. Okay, we're gonna move on. We're not talking history. Do we have to go up or down? We go up, baby. We go up. We go high. Hi, Robo hi Roblox. Jason Francis, hi. Where's all the steel? This is old, ancient, medieval. I know they look like matchboxes, right? This honestly is one of our favorite parks in New York. It was it was really cool when we decided the very first time, I still remember when the first time we came up here, we never even realized the gardens that are up here. We were just so impressed with the cloisters themselves. But then now that we explored it a bit, you find out how beautiful the gardens are down. And the trail and the path definitely will get your steps in with some amazing views. And tell Joe to find Treebeard from Lord of the Rings, says Triple G. <laughs> you know, like he was like probably my least favorite character in that whole thing. Oh. Gollum wasn't bad. Oh, he was horrible. The whole story is about Gollum. That's why I don't like him. You know who I didn't like? I'll tell you who I didn't like. No, you know who I didn't like? Pippin. Pippin. I didn't like Gollum because he was disgusting. Frodo was your least favorite cat. Pippin drove me nuts. I'm like, you're. Your least favorite? How really? could Frodo be your least favorite? Frodo was the best. Well, you know who Pippin I, drove me you know crazy. Who my favorite is, right? Sure. Oh, oh. Joe likes the dwarf. He likes Gimli. Joe is Gimli. Gimli's my favorite. <laughs> Look at these tree limbs. Oh my God. Randy, scary trees. Scary trees, Randy, if you're still here. 
Well, because everybody put the burden on Frodo Ambrose. Dark forest. Dark forest. That was ninth grade for you? Okay. You know who my favorite character was? No, that was your shoe. Holy crap, like, wow, we're like stretching around here. Yeah, good for sliding. Yeah. My favorite character in Lord of the Rings, Legolas. No, that was not my favorite character. It was always Legolas. Yeah, every park, you're right, Gregory, has its own personality. This one makes you feel like you are back in, like, could you imagine? Maybe, like, this is, had to be amazing for the people, like, when they first built it. Do you see how the view comes in? Look at the beautiful gardens. Like, they, they thought all of this through. I love it. Everywhere you look, guys, it's like a scene. It's so beautiful, the ivy. You took your kids to the Lord of the Rings, you fell asleep and let out a big snore during the quiet scene. Oh my Stop God. It. Lord of the Rings I love. Except the Gollum parts. Like they took me to one of the newer movies of Star Wars and I fell asleep. Joe was like mad because I was sleeping, I was snoring. Which movie did I walk on? Of, I hated Elliot too, from E.T. Which movie did I walk on? I don't know. This is beautiful. Look at this. Look at this garden. Yeah, you wouldn't even, you don't see this at all from the road. You actually have to walk in. That is beautiful. Is it a dogwood? I think it's a dogwood. They have to meet Papa. Lamb's ear. See, I know this is lamb's ear because it feels like a lamb's ear. It's so soft. You like adult comedies. It is, though, but it's so soft, guys. Did you guys ever touch this? It's like velvet. It's so cool. Oh, look at those bright hostas. Those are yellow. No, that is the color. Everything is so, like, oh, yeah. That's the, um, Flight of the Nagators. Yeah, it's like your dog's ears, exactly. Those are beautiful. You can actually smell all the flowers in here too. Hannah and her sisters. Oh, I didn't even see, I, I, I think I probably saw it once and I don't even know what it's about anymore. It's been that long. That's a London plane. It is big, they are big. The colors here are gorgeous. Oh, look at these. Oh, damn, those are some big-ass bumblebees. Oh, my God, Ambrose, I can't with you. You fell asleep during Harry Potter? Huh? Oh, there's a squirrel. Squirrel, wildlife. He's a fancy squirrel. He'd be fancy. Go hug a tree, Joe. Joe's gonna go hug a tree, guys. <laughs> I know, bees, I'm out. It's a big tree. It's a huge tree. Is it big, Joe? Do you feel you got some tree on you? Did you give it a tree hug? You can recite every line from every Harry Potter. I know the azaleas here are so beautiful. You have a white one called, you call it Iggy? Yeah, right? You made out during Schindler's List. Don't get too sappy. <laughs> that was good. Oh my God, if trees could talk, they'd be telling all the tea on us. 
Well, they are the keepers of the history. I could say some stuff about people. Randy, this chain is very old. Is it old, Joe? Okay. We're just getting a few of the, the what do you call it? Oh, another azalea. Hey, Harry W. Changed herself to a tree outside her house to save it. She lost her battle. Tree came down. Aw. What does that say? Let no one say and say it to your shame that all was beauty here until you came. Okay. It is really beautiful here. Yeah, just in 50, 56. This is up by the cloisters. Yeah, these are the peonies. They're all going to like pop. So gorgeous. And it's very quiet. There's a lot of places you guys can get up to and just take and sit. We might go sit up there a little bit just to watch people. This overlooks the Hudson. We know you guys will root out the answers. That's, a, that's an azalea. A little blurry? Down in the valley. Look at that one. That's so beautiful. Beautiful. Out of planted areas. Yeah, so basically don't walk into the garden. Walk on the path. Love diners and people watching. Two of my favorite activities. I know. I love people watching. Yeah, there is a bit of a fragrance. You can see it's very light. It's not overwhelming. The only thing better than people watching is people watching drinking coffee. It does. <laughs> it's the only thing better. One thing better is watching so people are having coffee. Peonies? So these are peonies too? Mm-hmm. Oh, hydrangea, maybe, no, those are peonies. Peonies? Because hydrangeas have multiple blossoms. These are like peonies. Okay. Such a lovely place to tell your significant other you found someone new. Oh my God. <laughs> That's terrible. Yeah, the colors are wonderful. I agree. It's just peaceful today. It's the Mother's Day. This is a little bit of a just Zen moment for us. Zen moment with JoJo. Those are beautiful purple. Joe oh, has no. always loved pansies, guys. Stop it. The way you said that was wrong. Rephrase Hi. that. Joe loves pansies? That doesn't sound good. Rephrase that. Oh, ranunculus. You're right. They are ranunculus. Those white flowers back there that were going to bloom. Why don't you say Joe likes... Purple flowers. Purple flowers. <laughs> <laughs> don't say Joe likes pansies. I don't that's like the what way they're that's, called. I don't like the way that projects. You got an azalea me. bush in front of your house, look magnificent for one week a year, and the rest of it, I know. That's the crazy thing. I like purple flowers. <laughs> Joe likes purple flowers. Thank you. He doesn't want me to say that they're pansies because he thinks I'm not a Joe pan loves pan I'm pansies. Not a pansy. <laughs> Gladiolas are nice too. <laughs> you could say that. I like gladiolas. I love azaleas. Really rolls off your tongue, but don't say Joe likes pansies. <laughs> oh come on. Oh, pansy kind of guy. This one. Can you imagine when this bush blooms? It's gonna be like, oh my gosh. But times a million. I know. That means run away. Run away from the bumblebees. Run away. I mean, the amount of work and time that has to go into a garden like this is enormous. To have an idea of how is it going to look when you get done. I, this is what happened last time we were here, guys. The last time we were here, Joe was like, Ange, Ange. He was taking so many pictures. He was taking so many pictures, guys. It was ridiculous. Whatever they are, they are stunning. I know. That's treating. That's what he's talking about. He's like somebody took some paint, spray paint, and painted it. 
I know. Isn't that amazing? I wanted to be able to show it to you guys before like the blooms all kind of fell off. Oh, the lilac bush is coming in. Look, there's the lilacs as well. It's so red, right? You almost think it's fake. It's so red. They had to put the big sign right in front of it because you know, you know, somebody's gonna wanna step in there and get their picture taken with them instead of just standing in front of them and, and doing this. <laughs> they gotta get in the bush. <laughs> That's usually what that happens. Oh, here's a, here's a bee. If it stings me, we're in trouble. It's busy, Angela. A lot of bugs are going after. It's got to get all the stuff. Bzz, bzz. There's a lot of bumblebees. I mean, this actually looks plastic. But no, I'm so serious. Classy. They actually step in and like stand in the middle of the bush so they get their pictures taken. That's what they were doing with all the other things. Like the green looks so green. <laughs> oh my God, RFD, you're right. Getting in the bush sounds just as bad as Joe likes pansies. <laughs> That's not how you say it. It's what you say. It's, it's amazing. And they have ferns, like these tiny little ferns and stuff everywhere. What are you doing, Joe? Joseph, it's not a car. There's this random car that Joe says is driving throughout the park and destroying everything. Yes, choose your words wisely. Yeah, is that what they did? Okay. Is that what happens? What else can Ben steal like that except me? <laughs> Did you just really say that? Joe poses. Joe always poses. He likes to stand. Ben steal like that. I know who can. A metal bender? I'm question you. Or a vehicle? Airbender? Let's see where the car track Did Joe have a dog? Yeah, he we used to have a dog. Joe's still sticking to his story. He's going to stick to that story till the end. Everybody loves a nicely trimmed bush. Analyzing the structural failure broke. It just broke. It was old. Okay, we're no. There's no car parts. That is a car part. That's a fender. Oh wait, look, look. That's a headlight. That's actually from something else. Oh my God, you're gonna deny the fact that's a headlight? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta go up the little stairs to our thing. There's car parts. We're on Linden Terrace, guys. Ooh, this is actually moving. Because he hit the whole damn thing. Look, we're looking over the Hudson Valley. Linden Terrace. I would like, I would like, I would like the whole audience to see the car parts that you didn't view. The headlight pieces that hit that. You won't show it because this is <laughs> fake news. Oh. I know that you didn't show the car parts. Well, because there's people there. No, you didn't show the car parts. Okay, there was some, some kind of parts of some kind of vehicle. So my theory is the same as that theory over there. Maybe. A vehicle did so that. you think people are driving up here? Down the pass when they're drunk. Maybe. Maybe that's what kids are doing. I don't know. We'll have to Google it. And I'll, and I'll talk about it tomorrow on the live. Done. You can't be done with me. I'm done with you because you know I'm right. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're wrong. <laughs> Joe Re Ari Sandals, the retired trooper, agree agrees with you. The retired trooper says yes. It is a car part, and people are crazy. That is cool. Not cool. It is. That is really cool. It's a great view. It's a great view. That's why they put a Ford up here. I think it was a drunk, drunk grandmother on her electric scooter. Nope, it was a vehicle. I know. Can you imagine seeing Sully land his plane? He did it past the GWB. Yeah, he did it past. But could you imagine like seeing this plane? It came down by the GWB. It came down. It circled down, and it's crazy. Over here, beyond the trees, you can see the GWB, the George Washington Bridge.
Let's go up here. We're gonna go look. I don't think it's one. I think it's a mocked one, the one that's inside the cloisters. <laughs> Let's go check it out. This would be an amazing place to have a wedding. I'm tired. Hi, Zenith. Did Joe just say he's tired? Joe's tired? Why is he tired, guys? It's because he had breakfast twice? Oh my God. Yes, he did. Look at Joe's exhausted. He's gonna take a sit down. Are you tired, little boy? Oh, you're good now because you're yeah, sitting down. Oh, look, they have plaques up here too. Every bench has a plaque. Oh, this was in loving memory of Madeline Aldrich. Dearest mother, grandmother, wife, sister, and friend. That was nice. Zoom in or zoom out for as long as I love you. You'll always have the benefit of the doubt. They were married here on July 26, 2014. Look, Mrs. Viking says, Joe, have a nappy nap. I lay down, I look like a hobo. <laughs> Did you just say that for real? I can't lay down because I'll look like I. If I lay down, I'll look like a hobo. You're so crazy. I'll sit up and nap me up upright. Oh my god. Guys, we cannot fix him. When I was here last time, when I looked out, there was a canopy of green. It was really pretty. It is super pretty up here. Super. And it's nice because it's quiet. The only thing you hear is a very distant sound of the road below us. But, I mean, we, you guys were with us in the car. How long did it take us to get here? 10 minutes? Hours. Look at the squirrel. Oh, God, guys. Look. If you put your hand out, he'll come to you. I'm not touching the <laughs> Joe, but maybe he wants to sit on your lap. What if he jumped up right on the, what if he jumped up on the thing? What if he jumped up on the, on the, on the seat? Would you run away? You have no food to offer? You sure you don't have any Tic Tacs in your pocket? No peanut butter today? You're good? Oh, he's coming this way. He's coming this way. He's going to get you, Joe. What am I? What am I? What are you, Snow White? Dr. Doolittle? You are. All the birds are coming to you. They're like, sir, sir, a burrow. Oh my God. The donkey, the donkey from the Dominican. That was really funny. I know we were, when we were in the Dominican, there was a donkey. It was basically a burrow. Was it a burrow? No, it was a, it was a donkey. It was big. And this thing came out, out of the woods, out of the jungle in the Dominican onto the beach and it walked right up to Joe. And Joe, the entire time Joe was saying, please don't come to me, don't come to me. And it walked literally, I have a picture of Joe standing next to it and he just looks like, I'm not gonna move. I don't want it to attack me. He was so funny. <laughs> Joe always ends up in some strange instance, I swear. It was really funny guys. But guys, I hope you liked your Mother's Day walk with us. Turned into Mother's Day sit down, but it's okay. Maybe Joe still smells like screwball. Maybe you smell like the peanut butter coffee. The peanut butter coffee? We're going back to that Wawa because that was sensational. That was all the way in Jersey. It's worth the trip. I if can't. that's a normal Wawa thing, you got to try Step the away from the coffee. squirrel. I know. Peanut butter coffee was delicious. It, it tasted was... like coffee screwball. I wonder if you should have put peanut butter in the coffee. You did. Did you put coffee in my peanut butter? <laughs> oh, that sounds so bad. <laughs> that sounds so bad. <laughs> you guys have a good mother's day you enjoy day. your sunday relax yeah today enjoy is a day to other. relax recoup and we have to get prepared for the next week yes. you failed the lottery again oh, next time There's what date is father time. day i don't know sometime in june i don't celebrate father's day <sighs> he's such a pain in the butt father's all right guys we will see you again next time guys. remember this week on tuesday i fly out it's going to be crazy streams it's going to be crazy. I don't know what we're going to do, but we'll do something. All right. We'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.